On August 2nd, basic camp cadets had the opportunity to help the troops overseas by giving blood. What we're doing here today is bringing all the cadets and their ability to give blood to the Armed Services uh, Blood Program, which is pretty awesome. So for folks that don't know what the Armed Services Blood Program is, uh, I just want you to think of this. Right now, the United States Army uh, is deployed uh, across 150 countries worldwide with about 165 soldiers deployed, most of them in dangerous areas and potential combat. Although the war has slowed down somewhat, we are still very much an army at war. So the, what the blood program does for us is gives us the ability to have a pre stock of blood for these soldiers, men and women, in the front lines to be able to have that supply when needed. As they like to say, they are the, the lifeline to the front line. If you think about that, those are powerful words. The lifeline to the front line, and that's exactly what the program uh, does for us. I'm a nurse, but I hate needles. Like, I hate needles, but um, I, it wasn't actually as bad, and knowing that it's actually going to a good cause it definitely helps, so. See, that actually makes me feel really good because I'm O negative, and that's a rare blood type, and that's the blood type that they're really needing. So it makes me feel good to be able to help out. Yesterday, I think we had about 400 cadets, about 360 of them donated blood. I mean, that ought to give you the numbers. Just for the folks out there to make, to, so they understand what we do here at Cadet Command for the Armed Services Blood Drive, let me tell you, it is the single largest supplier of blood and the biggest event in the aggregate over two and a half months that supplies uh, to the Armed Services Blood Program. So that's, that's pretty huge and it gives you that every single one of these kids wants to get. Despite everything, despite the message, the Armed Services uh, Blood Drive, this is about saving lives. I've been a recipient of this in country, and let me tell you, I'm here because of it, and most folks have to understand that. When they want to give, so everywhere I go, folks come up to me if I'm in uniform and say, you know, thanks for your service. This is their opportunity to give. And by the way, this is not just cadets, this is soldier and our DA civilians that provide blood for this program. We want to thank you and thank everything they do for our force. Reporting from CST Public Affairs Office, this is Matthew Barnes.